of artistic nudity were less common, although paintings of saints in the resurrection did also use nudity to symbolize the triumph of this spiritually purified body, the Renaissance, 1400 to 1500s, saw the rise of humanism and the rebirth of classical Greek and Roman culture. Even in Christian art, many felt that the perfection of the nude human form was the purest expression of the divine. After all, man was created in the image of God, nudity in Christian art can be categorized in four ways, one. Nuditas naturalis, representing the natural state of humanity before the fall point two. Nuditas temporalis, depicting poverty and the reliance on God for all that we receive point three. Nuditas virtualis, symbolizing purity and innocence. Four. Nuditas criminalis, representing the horror of lustful passions and vanity. And who is so barbarous as not to understand that the foot of a man is nobler than his shoe and his skin nobler than that of the sheep with which he is clothed. Okay, friends, that's all I've got for you.